So why might your dog need eye drops? So for Luke's case, he likes to play rough at the dog park and he even goes in the pool a lot. So he gets some conjunctivitis where his owner needs to give him antibiotic eye drops every so often. So I'm gonna show you how we give Luke eye drops and hopefully this helps you and your dog at home. So Luke's owner came to me because he was having trouble putting drops in his eyes because he was so energetic and he also would run away from him because he didn't like getting the drops put in his eyes. So I'm gonna show you guys how you can effectively put eye drops in their eyes when they don't wanna get the eye drops put in their eyes. So the first thing I told him was to keep Luke calm and not even show him the eye drops and just give him some chicken or some treats so that Luke knows everything is okay and he's totally relaxed before you put the eye drops in. So the second thing is using a leash. So get your dog's leash that they're comfortable with at home so you have control of your dog while you're putting the eye drops in them. And this way they know that they have to behave and get their eye drops over with. <laughs> so the third thing is getting them secure by holding their muzzle so that you can look at the eyes. Because you as the owner, you need to look at their eyes every day to make sure that their eyes aren't getting worse. Because if they have a corneal ulcer or a scratch, they can lose their eye if it doesn't get better. So you're the one who needs to make the judgment if you need to go back into the vet to get professional help with your dog's eyes. Open their eyes like this and tilt their head back and forth to get their eyes to move so you can see their entire eyeball. Because that little membrane in there will slip up and then sometimes you can't see the corner of their eye. But if you move their head, their eyes will track and you can see their entire eyeball. You can move it up, you can move it down. So we'll get the eye drops ready and putting it on the table like that so your caps are ready. Now that the caps are off the eye drops, you can just grab them and put the eye drops in. And I'm gonna use my left hand on his muzzle and I'm gonna put my palm like on his face, lift up his eyelid with my thumb and also some of my hands and put one or two drops in there. There you go, let him blink. Just like that. All right, and I'm, I'm scruffing his, his chin under here so that, so that I have control of him. So I have to put drops in the other eye, so the same thing is gonna happen. I'm still gonna use my left hand to hold him. It's all right, Luke, stay. You can use commands like stay. Lift their eyelid with your fingers, however's comfortable, and put those drops in, and let him blink his eyes. So the main thing, technique-wise, and confidence wise is I'm really leading my hand on his face. My palm is really on his face so that I can manipulate him. Don't be afraid to put pressure basically on his little doggy skull here. Put pressure on him so that he knows you're serious about this and then put those eye drops in. So that's how I do it. Um, so a lot of people are probably afraid to hold their dog's head like this, but you have to. You have to have confidence so that they'll sit there for you and then you make it as painless as possible, goes as quick as it is, and then your dog's not afraid because he knows that's how it goes. All right guys, I hope this video helped you put eye drops in your dog's eyes, whether they were energetic or simply nervous about getting eye drops. If this video helped you, please smash that like button and hit the thumbs up to help YouTube suggest my videos to more pet parents.